Mr. Vella, we, we read and heard some news from uh, Bulgaria about some players leaving the club and the president leaving the club. What can you uh, tell us about it? How does it involve your preparation of the game of tomorrow? Until now, uh, you know, uh, three players going from, from the club to to next uh, to another club, Cesica Sofia. And I expect it to to be a very tough game tomorrow. Uh, we know that. Uh, Vitesse is a very strong team at, at home. Uh, support with uh, their good f uh, fans. But uh, we will try everything for the big Vitesse tomorrow. With uh, every pro problems, they support us. You know that uh, our president is uh, owner is going, and uh, from now we uh, start to be um, very difficult for us. Mm -hmm. But maybe next week, uh, starting to speak uh, with another owners, and maybe something new is. It's better. How was for you to uh, lose four players in one week? It started with Duxon, who was sold, and then the other three, the two French guys, the guy from Portugal. Yeah, you know? I speak about this in Bulgarian newspaper. It's very difficult for me and for our team because uh, it's going very good players. But uh, I hope that uh, the new players will start tomorrow. It's, it's be okay. How are the chances? You believe? W what chance does Plovdiv have to go to the next round? <laughs> yes. uh, score one, one score more from Vitesse. One, score one, one, one goal more. more. Yes. yes. Okay, but how? How big is the chance? Like uh, the first game, I think fifty-fifty. Uh, it's still 50-50, you think? Despite all the players who, uh, who left the club? We, you'll see tomorrow new players. You have some new surprises. Maybe. <laughs> yeah. And what is the atmosphere in the club? Uh, now a little bit uh, uh, minority in the club because, you know, the situation is not... Uh, very st stabilities, but uh, I know that uh, my players is professional and they try everything to play good tomorrow. You have few young uh, players. Are you going to? Yes, yes. Why not? We have three, four young players. And uh, because the group is only sixteen people. Yeah, seventeen. Seventeen. We have only three substitutes. I think it's, it's enough. enough. <laughs> On the list here are 16 players. 17. 17, but then yeah. you have six substitutes. No, list. no. I mean, uh, the, the game, the game coming in only three substitutes. Oh, yeah. oh, mm -hmm. yes. What was your impression of Vitesse? What was the, the strength of Vitesse, in your opinion? I think that it's, they play very good here, very strong, and uh, 
attractive. They have uh, very strong players and good uh, technical players. Young. But they're also a bit vulnerable in defense. Four goals. Your team too, but... Okay, so <laughs> maybe I don't uh, want to speak uh, more. Mm -hmm. You see tomorrow. Do you expect an ego game last as last week with a lot of goals? A lot of goals. It's uh, good for the fans. Of course, but do you also expect it? To Before happen? the game, uh, the the coach of uh, Vitesse said to come in Bulgaria to win, hundred percent. Yeah. But after the game, he was a little bit nervous and said that uh, we play with uh, many, many players uh, in the front. Interesting. Uh, but uh, we'll see tomorrow. Can you tell us how important is this game for Lokomotiv Plovdiv? I think it's uh, very important because if uh, we win and go the next round, good for us, uh, uh, good for uh, Mr. Kokodinev. He still like uh, love the team. Maybe in the new owner also good for him.